everybody, so this is just a quick update to the uh, retro station hack. Uh, save states are now enabled on the hack, so we're just going to go ahead and go through that. Same deal, you're going to get your system bin and drop it into a USB drive and run the update. Oops. And it should say save states added uh, version 1.1 FBA for RS. That'll be the same, 2022-1217. So here we go, we're going to go ahead and run it. Commando. So we're just going to go ahead and go in and test it on a few games. So as you can see, there's nothing in the um, save states right now. No load. I mean, nothing to load. So we're gonna. I'm sorry. Should have just started the game. create a save state here. You can select uh, wherever you want to put it. Go ahead and put it here. And there it is. We'll go ahead and exit the game. Start the game up again. Uh, one of the things that I'll mention is that uh, in order to run this update, you'll have to uh, return it to normal. What's it called? Reset to default or reset system. Basically, uninstall the hack and then reinstall it through the uh, update, which I'll do next, I guess. Anyways, so here's the game. Just gonna load up a save. You go to load. And uh, here's one here. So I'm just kind of like in the middle of the stage, right? So go ahead and exit out of there. Start up Samurai Showdown 2. Load up the save. So like I said, uh, in order to install the update, uh, you'll just have to go here, reset to default settings. Now, whenever you reset to default settings and you've already applied this uh, this new update with the save states, it will clear out all your save states. So just something to note. Um, but you're doing this for the first time, you won't have the save states, so that's it's not really a, a big deal. But. Yeah, you'll, you'll just basically go to result, reset to default settings and hit OK. And it'll just get you back to stock. And then um, once you do that, it'll uh, allow you to install the new update, which is what I'm going to do right now. It's kind of like getting going back to where we started. So once you're back to default, I already have the USB in there. Um, it'll detect the new update and you'll just go from there and start it all over again. But that's it. Uh, the uh, update file should be in the description. The link to the update file should be in the description. Uh, but yeah, that should be it, man. Check it out. Enjoy.